So Mars Rover, because different teams of scientists and engineers coming together to make something so difficult happen. The fact that you could land a remotely operated vehicle millions of miles away uh, and it remained there for years on end carrying out experiments is just fascinating. This machine here enables us to mass produce nanofibers which I use in my filters. I think if you had to pin me down to one, I'd say the Pantheon. The submarine. The engineering challenges involved with that are just mind-boggling. Voyager 1 and Voyager 2 project, amazing. I'm inspired by these. These have changed the way we think, we live and we interact with other people. Elon Musk's uh, Falcon Heavy, uh, that was a rocket that launched into space with two boosters uh, and as well as a central core and all Three of those parts of the rocket came back down to Earth. Photoacoustic technologies that help us understand in exquisite detail the blood vessels around a tumour. I stood in a dry dock underneath an aircraft carrier. It's just this inconceivably massive ship hanging above you on blocks. Literally a few decades after we invented, invented a plane, we were able to go to space. Ships, I've um, dedicated my career towards seeing how various offshore platforms can, can function. The space shuttle that was designed by NASA in the 80s, so really, I find that incredible. All of the contributions of engineering to healthcare. The most inspiring feat of engineering that we can ever observe all around us is nature. And that is the very reason why I'm working in engineering.